Now let's see, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is November 25th of 2018. I had someone, as you can see, leave a comment because I reviewed this app. Oops, where's the app? That's not the app, that's the... Uh... Well, anyway, I reviewed the app. And let's see. I found it to be 10 points off, so I gave it a thumbs down. But it was suggested that maybe, although the instructions say you do not cover the flash, but maybe I should cover the flash. Also, it says tip. And when I did it, I did, you know, I didn't do the tip. But on the instruction little thing here, they show you doing it with the... But so I'm going to try this again. Try to be fair to this app person or whatever. So uh, begin measurement. First of all, I'm going to put my finger over the lens. I'm not covering the flash. Begin measurement. Allow. Okay. We're going to get a blood, or a uh, pulse rate, heart rate, and I guess I should show it to you. You might think I was cheating or something. 68. Hmm. Before, of course, that was a few days ago. It was 60. Okay, I'm going to. Uh, Take my finger off and go back to the heart rate again. Okay. I'm going to put my finger, I see, I'm going to put my finger over. Well, if I put the tip, it doesn't. Okay, I'm going to put my whole finger over the light. And it's kind of hard to. Okay, I'm going to do it like that. I'm going to do next. Begin measurement. You don't see a, you don't see a flash this time because it's covered. The flash is covered up. Okay. Looks like it's going to be the same. Sixty-seven. Okay, well, sixty-eight. Hmm. Okay, now I'm going to do my heart rate with my. Uh, uh, that probably won't be good if I get it there too tight, will it? blood pressure and at the bottom we will get heart rate Ooh, the blood pressure is a little bit high it's quite a bit high Ooh, that's not good wait a minute here okay 72 well that's pretty close uh, that's pretty close Hmm. Wasn't too tight up there, was it? Well, let me try. Let me try with this shirt off, just in case. But if I can get it off, that well, my blood that'll make my blood pressure go up. Just taking my shirt off will do that. sign when your blood pressure goes up from doing, doing absolutely nothing, you know. Okay, uh, I'm going to do it again. 
Whoops. Okay. By the way, this uh, blood pressure cup thing is uh, pretty nice. I've been using it for what well, we could look up and see from when I purchased it. But I may put a link to it below. Over 78. Okay, well, went from 72 to 78. And that's... Uh, Okay, we're going to do this again. Should I put my finger over? Well, they say I'm going to put it, I'm not going to put it over the flash. I'm going to put it back, mail, next. Don't know if we could see the flash. This time we could see the flash because I don't have my finger over the flash. So this is going to be Yeah, see it's giving the measurement like it did. Hmm. Sixty nine. Well it's not let's see. I don't know. I'm still... I'll leave it up to y'all. You know, they do have a... Uh, you can use this for free. Or you can install it, try it, and then you can pay a little bit for a pro version or something. So I'll still let you decide. I, I don't think I'm going to change my... Uh, comments before. Um, but I will add the Amazon link for this. And... I think that's probably it. By the way, I did get my new keyboard. Hang on a second. Ah. Here's the box for it. Uh, this is not a review. I'm not going to. I may, I may not even do a. review of it, but I'll tell you about it from time to time, let you know how how it's going. Uh, I watched a ton of, as you know, I usually do, watched a whole ton of the uh, YouTube reviews of this, and the, some of them were a couple years old or whatever, and uh, I was kind of concerned, even though I ordered it after reading their reviews, because of the comments that people made. Usually, uh, a lot of the products that I buy will get wet, wet, you know, just great reviews. This got okay reviews, but not great. People complained that uh, for $180, it's plastic and they wanted uh, aluminum. And I agree, I have a couple of aluminum keyboards that I love. But to me, this feels okay. Uh, looks okay, feels okay. Uh, people also uh, made some comments about the keys. 
And the keys seem fine to me. Yes, they, for some reason, the keys have, they vary on here. Like uh, the Z and the X have a, a little ridge to the right, apparently. They have a little lip. Okay, there's things that are a little bit different about the They're not all uniform. And there was complaints about that. Um, what were the other complaints about? There were a few complaints, and so far I have no no complaint. Now there is a let me see if I can move this over here a little bit. There's this place here which you can set your cell phone in there. And there's actually, I think, using Bluetooth. I don't even pay attention to it. Doing Bluetooth, there's some stuff you can do that'll record something. It'll show you something. I'm not even interested in that. There were some complaints about that. Uh, some people wanted a uh, some type of more connect connectivity that way. So that's something I'm not concerned with at all. Um, now I can see uh, a pass-through. This is plugged, of course, into it's a keyboard, so it's plugged into uh, USB. And some people would like to have a USB port here that you could use, or even maybe two. I can understand that. Uh, one of my keyboards that is aluminum, you know, it does have an extra port. One of them has two extra ports, and they're 3.0. Uh, so I can see that point. Um, now the software is really nice. Let's see if I can find it here. It's kind of slow and I'm this is the software. And the Logitech software, uh, I already had it installed, but of course it was just controlling my uh, mouse and my uh, camera. But once I uh, hooked up the keyboard, I can now control, set up all types of things here with this. I'm not going to go into it with this you know, at this time, but the, uh, this is for customizing, you know, all the programmable keys. You can do a whole bunch with it. Haven't really gone to that very much. Uh, this is the, uh, game mode. And I, as you, I have civilization, uh, six installed and it found the, uh, profile for that. Change the color of the keyboard a little bit. Um, now here's the coloring, I think. Yeah. No, that's not. Let's see, where is the coloring here? Is it? Yeah. So, let's see, let me aim this down a little bit. I should turn out the... To turn out the lights. This is not going to be uh, so. I haven't really played with this. Let me kill the, one of the lights here. Now, this camera really isn't doing justice to the uh, keyboard. Well, let's see what we have. We have uh, Contrastic. 
beep blooper, I guess, or beep bloop. Yeah, you're not really seeing the effect on, you're seeing it up here, but uh, pretty amazing. Caterpillar. Data fall. Explosion. You just have a tremendous uh, the ocean waves. Rainbow ripple. And you have the settings that can cycle. Gives you the speed. Okay, a whole bunch of stuff. Let's go here. And trying to get it back to uh, normal. I guess this is normal here. Except I could change this. This is light blue, I guess, or dark blue. So, uh, I think it's, oh, by the way, uh, the reviews that I was reading, people were talking about the price being, uh, you know, 108 for, they would say, you know, well, it's just for $180, it's, uh, you know, too much. Well, I paid, I think, about $90 for it, let's see. So let's see, orders, here's the keyboard, yeah I paid $89 for it, and that's still the price by the way, for it, and that, so an awful lot of people are saying well 108, and then I, I saw people that did reviews that were you know saying what's well, $180, and there were some that said it was $140. And right now it's uh, $90. I think a great, very happy with it. Um, so I may talk more about it and maybe get into the light, lighting a little bit and get into some maybe programming of the keys or something. What was the other thing that I mentioned? Oh, yeah, the blood pressure thing. Anyway, I'll put the link to the keyboard. And I'll put the link to the, let's do that. Let's go to uh, Amazon. Go to orders and blood pressure. See how many of them pull up here. Okay. Um, Okay, none of these three are, oh, this is it. Yeah. Yeah, this is it. I'll put the link to, I purchased this in 2015. Um, and I'll just happen to mention again, by the way, that uh, Amazon, I had over, I don't know how many, I think over 200 reviews on Amazon, including for this device and other devices and uh, Amazon thought that I was uh, I guess being unfair and giving people ratings higher than what they should have got and with no notice to me or warning or anything they just deleted all my I never got an email from them I never got an I didn't even I didn't get even get an email saying hey your reviews are removed <clears throat> but so that's what pissed me off the fact that I would, if they just sent an email and said, well, we don't approve of your reviewing. And so, you know, you're not going to be up. So anyway, they, uh, they removed all, and every one, every one of my reviews had a video with it. So I wasn't just doing the written review part. I was doing a video with it. 
and uh, they removed them all. No notice to me that they were upset. No ability to appeal. I wouldn't have appealed anyway. Um, didn't tell me they removed them. They also didn't tell me that I couldn't post a, re a uh, review. So, you know, not only did they, of course, remove the, my reviews, I can't even review any of these items on Amazon. So, I guess that's it. I'm going to upload this. Uh, I think the audio will be okay. I think the video will be okay. I think the camera color, though, is... Let me go in here to the... Uh, Move us out of the way. Go to the camera. Where are you, camera? No, that's my mouse. Gaming software. I have no idea what that is. I, that's something new I haven't seen before. I have to go back. Well, let me click on it. Not sure what it does. Anyway. Oh. Okay, th that's something I haven't seen. Huh. These, by the way, are things I have never played, you know, that I do actually have on Steam. Hmm. Okay, where am I heading? Camera. Is this the camera? No. Settings? No. I meant camera. No, this is just for... Uh, well, click on default, see what happens. Nothing. Okay. okay. Here's the camera. Okay. Uh, default. Now, I think the, the coloration has been, uh, let's see, uh, go back to 90. We don't need to zoom in, no, please. No zooming. Streaming. No, go back to 90. Field of view. Custom. Default. Now watch the color. Nope, didn't change. Let me take off HDR and do default. Video settings. Maybe that'll Let's see. Default. There we go. So I think that's a problem because I did that before. Um, and it went back to the not so bright, sort of almost black and white. Um, zombie. Cartoon, custom, black and white. Okay, that's the black and white. Sickness. Someone call 911. Black and white. Custom. Let's see if that's default. Okay, um, got a feeling it's going to pop into that black and white mode again. I think that's some type of a uh, little problem because I went in here and played with these settings and then I got that black and white thing and then I went in and uh, changed it back to the better coloration that you see now and then when I started up this program it uh, that might be it it might save that for you know when I did that now we'll see what happens but uh, so that might be it. It might be remembering it for whatever program I was using at the time. So maybe we'll be okay with this. So I do love the software <clears throat> that I'm using the uh, Logitech. I think it's the G602. Now I need the light on. And yeah, the G602 mouse. And I'm using the uh, Logitech uh, Brew, Brew, or whatever it is, uh, camera. 
and then the keyboard. So, by the way, the mouse, the G602, is supposed to have unbelievably long battery life. And when I first installed it, the first day or whatever, I mentioned, well, I don't know about that. Uh, but uh, I've been using it. I just had to replace the batteries today. So I guess, too, I'll mention the, uh, put a link to the mouse. Anyway, thank you very much for uh, watching.